Hey everyone, so today's challenge is creating a lava lamp. So if you think about your regular lava lamp, if any of you have any, um, you have a two differing liquids in there. Um, one with color is moving up and down, um, and that's because of a heat source that it has. So we're going to be talking about density today. Um, so the less dense something is, the higher it'll rise. The if it's heavier, if it's more dense, it's actually going to pull down to the bottom. So we're going to have two items today, two liquids for you in your bag. You're going to see a small water bottle. And you're going to get two small containers of oil as well. For us to actually create this, we're not going to have a heat source. We're actually going to use Alka-Seltzer tabs. And then you'll also see food coloring in there as well. So to get started, you're going to want to drink that water bottle. Not all the way, but all, maybe about three-fourths of it. Um, since it is summer, it's a great time to be drinking water. All right, and what I'm trying to get it to go to is kind of at the bottom of that label. One more. All right, that sounds good. Um, so once you have it at the bottom, you also want to see your whole uh, lava lamp working. So I'm actually going to take off this tag as well. Okay, after you remove your label, you're actually going to put some food coloring in there. You can put about five drops. That should be good. Mine are going to be green. So you're going to have that mix in there. Then you're going to put in your oil. So you have two containers in your bag for this. Um, if you have any more oil at home, that's also good to use. The more you have, the better that lava lamp is going to come out. All right. And as you can see, the water is more dense than your oil. So that's why it's sinking down to the bottom. And your oil is not as dense, so it's actually on the top of that portion. What you're going to do next is put in your Alka-Seltzer cap. So you can actually cut this in half or break it off in half. That way it fits in your bottle. And when you put it in there, you're going to see that some bubbles are actually going to start rising up. You see those green bubbles. Um, and you're, what you're creating is some carbon dioxide gas is coming out from that water, reacting with that Alka-Seltzer, and then bringing those back up to the top if you look at the top, it's actually then releasing that carbon dioxide and making that water dense again. So that's where it's coming back down. And there you have it. Got your lava lamp. Hope you all enjoyed. Send us a picture. Send us a video on our Remind app so that way we can see your comments.